hopefully cue ball in behind the black here. This could be a frame winner if he gets this right. Excellent shot. Very, very good. And that worked out, wasn't it? Yeah, good plan. Good a little sequence of shots uh, I thought when he came straight in that pink it was nothing much doing but that was well worked out and, and yeah Ken called it well I put a line in there Alan he's got to maybe there it may not be but he's got to go very close to the blue and try and slide just by the blue onto the right hand side cushion somewhere hit the bulk line what way would you play it well, it, it all depends if he feels the blues in the way, doesn't yeah. it? It looks like he's playing it direct, two cushions. Almost trying to go around the back of the red. Oh. I don't think it has the pace, has it? Has it got the pace? Maybe it has. Maybe it has. Oh! <laughs> what a shot! <laughs> what a shot that is! Push the pink to the side cushion, perhaps. Bit of safety, or a bit of insurance for later. I'll tell you what, though, this looks pretty good. This looks pretty good. Oh, he's played one. Cometh the out, cometh the snooker. What an effort that was. I'll tell you what, I'll tell you what, oh. In the last five minutes, well, I think we've seen three or four shots where teams have all been drawn out of fairs and the decider looks certain to be just that as well. What a response though from Brazil. Oh, this is amazing. There's another one. Just weld this cue ball to the brown. Green ball. No, didn't play the pot. <laughs> Obviously. Well, I said that he wanted to be tight. But he's allowing Gary to come off the right hand and left hand cushions here. Should have really nailed that. Had to force Gary off the back cushion. Well, look at this again. Amazing. I tell you what, Gary's played some to get out of these snookers. We've already said he spent time earning a living as a taxi driver. The way he's played in this match, he could be a geometry professor. Wonderful, but from here, it would take a genius. This could be fiendish. Get out of that one. Well, I think the only shot he's got on here is to rattle the whites in the jaws and hopefully get anywhere near the reds. Well, you need to get the A to Z out again. What a truly horrible snooker. Well, he's got to play the jaws, I think. Does he think there's a, an angle there? Does he think there's a gap there? He's looking to go between the yellow and the brown, but well, he might catch the pink on the way back. Well, this will be some shot if he catches the reds here. He 
You're kidding me. You're kidding me. Unbelievable. As an entirety, Gary Wilson's escaping from snookers in this match has been some of the best I've ever seen from anyone, anytime, anywhere. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching the lengthiest frame in 42 years of World Championship snooker here at the Crucible. Brilliant. Highest break so far in this frame for Wilson is eight. Brussels' highest break is 12. <laughs> but Wilson could be about to reserve his best for last. This is missable under these conditions. But he's got it. Brown and blue needed. This has been absolutely amazing. Well, that's what it means to him. That's what it means to him. What a performance from both players. Gary Wilson, what a tactical performance in that closing frame, and ultimately, what a clearance under pressure. The decider was lengthy, it was gripping, and it's gone to Gary Wilson. The first seed is out of this year's World Championship. Luca Bissell defeated, edged 10-9 by Gary Wilson.